Hey Whovians, welcome back. This is only my second finale of Doctor Who. Oh my god! We ended on a pretty good one. A lot of setup for what is about to unfold. I will be watching Torchwood, which I'm so excited about, and I just found out that it was more rated R vibes or mature or whatever, but living in the same universe, that's so cool. It's kind of like Angel in the sense of it being darker, and I was told that another creator compared the two, so like I already like get it, but it seems Torchwood is even more adult. Like I think there's like sex scenes and stuff. Can't wait. <laughs> and then I'm going to be reacting to Sarah Jane as well. Most likely only on Patreon. I might put the first two episodes out in one and then kind of go from there. Yeah, I'm really excited. Could Rose be dying in this episode? I don't think so. I'm so excited though to see what's about to go down. I truly don't know. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my YouTube memberships or Patreon to get the YouTube edits early. Patreon for the uncut reactions. Let's get into it. Oh my god, guys, I can't. My name, my is, name Rose is Rose Tyler, Tyler and this is the day. Bitch, you're confusing me. I'm pretty sure you're in next season. I'm not Can ready. That's not your father. This is a story of how I died. This is crazy. She's going to die, but like, what does that mean? Also, I called him Christopher Russell. <laughs> Russell T. Davis, maybe. I forgot about the Daleks. Listen you're to your bad Daleks. wolf mother. I know your name. Think about it. How can I know that? A human who knows about the Daleks and the Time War. If you want to know how, then keep us alive. That's all I'm asking. Okay, so we have two classic... Is it villains? Classic who villains? I feel like villain is more of a fantasy term. Oh, they didn't die. Hmm, how boring. You guys need to send grenades. This ain't gonna cut it. Okay, like that, yes. They need a tank. No, we don't work like that. This is my responsibility. No. Anything you need, you come through me. Leave these two alone. You I mean, kneel. he would be most important to the Daleks, wouldn't he? Need information current and history. Yeah, well, I can give you a certain amount of intelligence. But... Beach is not necessary. They're so much Brain bigger waves. than. Oh shit. In that case, that is insane. I can't believe this is a finale right now. Ooh. Are they gonna get along? They're working together, right? I like that the Cybermen have the teardrop thing. I feel so helpless right now. Oh wow, I feel like the Daleks are stronger. Why haven't they killed her? They must need her for something. Protect the Genesis Ark. The Genesis Ark? That's a fire. I had a feeling they weren't. I figured they were stronger. I didn't want her to die, kind of low key. That emotions destroy you. Quite like hope. Hope's a good emotion. And here it One comes. of the best. Is that Jay? Slay. Doctor, good to see you again. I have chills. Jay? Cyberman came through from one world to another, and so did we. 
I wonder at this point if they knew or not they were gonna scrap the Jake gay storyline. Like I wonder if now he's just straight or if there's any more gay innuendos. Defend this room. You can't just just hop from one world to another. You can't. We just did. But they did. With these. But that's impossible. You can't have this sort of technology. We've got our own version of Torchwood. They developed it. Do you want to come and see? No! Parallel Earth, parallel Torchwood. Hmm. I've got to get back. Rose is in danger and our mother. Better be Jackie. Oh. My wife in a parallel universe. This time I know who you are. Fine, hooray, but I've got to get back right now. You're not in charge here. This is our world, not yours. And you're going to listen for once. Uh, don't want to listen. In the time war. Daleks evolved so they could use it as a power supply. I wonder if Rose is gonna get the power back and then this time it's gonna kill her in the way that it killed the doctor. How is she gonna live? She said this is a story about how I died so she has to die or that will be underwhelming but I don't want her to die. What's inside? The future. Is it like their dimension? Or their Doctor Who video games? Or computer games? Look at it. A world of peace. We're calling this the golden age. Who's the president now? A woman called Harriet Jones. I'll keep an eye on her. I'm sure we're gonna see her again, but I really expected her to be a bigger part in the show. I've been trying to tell you, travel between parallel worlds is impossible. Every time you jump from one reality to another, you rip a hole in the universe. This planet is starting to boil. You can seal the breach. Leaving five million Cybermen stranded on my Earth. That's your problem. I'm protecting this world and this world only. Hmm. There is a chance. Back on my world, Jackie Tyler might still be alive. My wife died. Her husband died. Good match. There's more important things at stake. Doctor. Interesting. Help us. Off we go then. Let's do it. N3. North corner staircase three. Just keep low. We're trying our best. Because if these are going to be my last words, then you're going to listen. I met the Emperor and I took the time vortex and poured it into his head and turned him into dust. It was sick. Did you get that? The God of all Dalit. And I destroyed him. <laughs> you will be exterminated! Oh, now, hold on, wait a minute. Not the 3D glasses. And Mickey, 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 nice to see ya. Oh, uh, he said his name. How did you survive the time war? By fighting on the front line. Period. But I'll tell you what it does do. It is very good and at opening, opening doors. doors. <laughs> Come on. <gasps> oh no. Thirteen square miles. Move Genesis Arc That looks like a penis. Oh, we're gonna run into her, right? Daddy. Pete. Perhaps. Hello, Jax. We're repeating Zendaya, history. That's not fair. Why him? You died 20 years ago, Pete. Pete from a different universe. Every single decision we make creates a parallel existence, a different dimension where... Oh, you can shut up. Come here. I have full-blown fucking chills everywhere. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Bingo. Yeah, let your son stand there. Just another day in the neighborhood. Slay. Oh my god, hurry. Oh, fly time. Time Lord Science? What Time Lord Science? What is it? Beats me. I kind of figured, right? 
bigger on the inside. The time lords put those Daleks in there. What for? Are it's they a prison ship? How many Daleks? So millions. Millions. Holy shit. But there's another world just waiting for you, Jax. And it's safe. As long as the doctor closes the breach. Oh, I'm ready. At least he's smiling. That's where the Daleks were hiding, and the side men traveled through the void to get here. And you lot, one world to another, fire the void. Oh, I like that. Fire the void. Look. <laughs> Three minutes. Void stuff. The only one who hasn't been through the void, your mother. You're sending the Daleks and Cybermen to hell. Precise. Man, I told you he was good. <gasps> You're all contaminated. We'll get pulled in. That's why you've got to go. Back to Pete's world. I'm opening the void, but only on this side. You'll be safe on that side. And then you close it for good. It'll close itself, and that's it. Kaput. For you to stay on this side. So maybe well, she died because she's leaving this universe. That's why I got these. I'll just have to hold on tight. I've been doing it all my life. I'm supposed to go to another world, and then it gets sealed off. Yeah. Forever. <laughs> that's not going to happen. We haven't got time to argue. I've had 20 years without you, so button it. I'm not leaving her. You've got to. Well, that's tough. I've had a life with you for 19 years. That's not enough. But then I met the doctor. All the things I've seen him do for me, for you, for all of us, for the whole stupid planet and every planet out there, he does it alone, Mum. But not anymore, because now he's got me. Switch. But I've got to go back! The doctor said every time I use one of these, it damages the whole world. Once the bridge collapses, that's it. You will never be able to see her again, your own mother. I made my choice a long time ago, and I'm never going to leave you. So what can I do to help? Those coordinates over there, set them all at six. <sighs> hurry up! I'm a little conflicted, I think. I just, like... Get away from me! <laughs> my mother means everything to me, I'm like, you know. That's the Torchwood one, Pass. the leader. Move on. Press the red button. It is the doctor! Exterminate him! Uh oh. When it starts, just hold on tight. Shouldn't be too bad for us, but the Daleks and the Sidemen are steeped in void stuff. You ready? Hurry. <sighs> we'll hit the switch. She's gone. No. I have chills. <laughs> She's gonna go. They did it. Close the breach. <laughs> Him screaming like that, I could, I can't take that. I want to start next season right now. Next series. Him screaming Rose like I'm, it's stuck in my head right now, destroying me inside. That, is that it? Yeah, it can't be it. Last night I had a dream. I heard a voice and it was calling my name. Rose. I told mum and dad and Mickey. They believed it because they've met the doctor. Mm -hmm. So they listened to the dream. This is very interesting. And that night we packed up. A total serve. And off we went. Where? We followed the voice because he's calling. Rose. Here I am at last. And this is a story of how I died. 
dog. Ah. Where are you? Inside the TARDIS. There's one tiny little gap in the universe left, just about to close. I'm burning up a sun just to say goodbye. You look like a ghost. Hold on. Can I? I'm still just an image. No touch. I didn't come through properly. The whole thing was fracture. So? <laughs> Where are we? Where did the gap come out? We're in Norway. Norway? About 50 miles out of Bergen. How long have you got? About two minutes. I can't think of what to say. <laughs> I got that. I love you. You've still got Mr. Mickey then? Yeah. There's five of us now. Mum, Dad, Mickey, and the baby. You're not. No. <laughs> <gasps> Mom. A sibby. The has gone. More Tyler's on the way. So the tortured on this planet's open for business. <laughs> I think I know a thing or two about aliens. Rose Tyler, defender of the Earth. You're dead, officially, back home. So many people died that day and you've gone missing. You're on the list of the dead. Mm. Am I ever going to see you again? <laughs> you can't. Like, I don't know how to act. Really, like, it's this her last time on the show. Like, I don't think so. <laughs> I so, love you. Say it back. And I suppose it's my last chance to say it. They never said it. I love you, Rose Tyler. Rose Tyler. <gasps> oh, you bitch. Say it. Give us it. I guess don't tell me if this is her last episode or not. It really could be the end for her. It can't be. But like, here we're gonna have a send off for her twice, like, if she does come back, cause I know she's not on it forever. Oh, what? What? What are you? Who are you? Where am I? What? What the hell is this place? Uh, what? Has she just been replaced like that? Billy Piper, I love you. Alrighty guys, I'm very confused and concerned. I think that might be it for her. I'm like pretty shocked about that. I guess maybe you guys can't tell me yet. Forget the show for a second, like the real life of it. Like did Billy Piper wanna leave? Like was this part of the plan? Was her contract up she didn't renew it like how could you leave the show like it's it's a great opportunity anyways okay so remember how i said the robot thing is kind of like boring for me because like there's no there's nothing to connect to it was definitely elevated in the finale and this episode compared to like the two-parter the first two-parter with them though the second part of the first two-parter was good too i still kind of have that vibe a bit earlier in this episode i was kind of like let's just what's going on like come on because i just have no feeling towards them where it's really connected probably for the classic whovians probably brings out more of emotion to it i guess and feel and stuff i thought that was really cool i just don't care to see them again like i hope that's kind of the end of them daleks get the hell away from me bye i'd rather the cybermen than the daleks i think actually but both of them can go i'm ready for something new oh my god i really think that that's the end of rose and i just think it's so crazy that she doesn't ever return even from like the actor's point like what is it oh my god the way the doctor screamed rose that instantly if that scene like kept going i feel like i would have bawled my eyes out if she died like that oh my god the emotion the acting is 10 out of 10 11 out of 10 i'm so excited to continue i wish i could literally do it right now i really have the power but i need to contain myself damn it I'm a loss for words, honestly. I don't know how I feel. I don't know. I really don't. I can't believe Sarah Jane was never mentioned again. I would have thought they would have gave her a bigger setup, especially for her getting her own show. But again, she goes back to classic Who. So the same with the Prime Minister. I thought she would come back maybe in the series finale i'm honestly just at a loss for words i hope you guys liked the reaction i'm like stressed out right now please give this a thumbs up subscribe if you're new comment below what you guys can comment 
and I'm happy that this is going on Patreon first because I know you guys will be good about the spoilers, whether to like say something or not. All right, Slayers, I hope you had a great time. Like, that's not even how I end it here. All right, bitches, I'll see you guys later. It's Billy.